Here at the Lyric Theatre in Brisbane, where Moulin Rouge will be opening on Saturday night, we're getting a sneak peek, but we're also joined by Moulin Rouge royalty, Baz Lerman. Baz, thank you so much for giving us your royalty, time. Thank you, royalty. You now, know you're all being called royalty. <laughs> now, look, it's so exciting to be here in Brisbane. How are you feeling to see this show come to life here at the Lyric Theatre? No, no. Well, I mean, uh, you know, look, I, my family and I, we came here to make a movie several years ago. We've become so enamoured of of Queensland in general, but um, you know, my dad's from the Afton Tableland. It's a very special place. It's very special and very meaningful. And you know, I can tell you that the show that began during the pandemic in Melbourne has just grown and grown. And the quality of this production, of course, visually it's great, but the sound in this theater is the best sound I've ever heard. It is so like a rock show. It is so exciting. And I am coming on Saturday night with my my own family as an audience member just to enjoy it. So I'm, we're thrilled about it. And if I'm correct, that's the first time that you'll be seeing this show in yeah. Australia. Yeah, for, I'm, yeah um, for one reason or another, I was never able to be in the country when they were doing different versions of it. And so I will be seeing it for the first time this Saturday night. And I know it's legendary because all around the world people say, oh, we must see the Australian production. And it was my dear, dear friend, Simon Burke, who we began together in the theatre like, oh, a few years ago, I won't mention numbers, but he's in it. And there have been electrifying audiences all through Australia and it's, it's absolutely at its peak right now. And I guess, what are you most looking forward to seeing? The set is incredible, the costumes are amazing, but I mean, for you personally, is there a number? Is there something in particular that you just can't wait to see on Saturday? Well, I was just saying the other day, I mean, I had something to do with creating the movie and I certainly was around during the Broadway production of this and then it won the Tony Awards for Broadway and all of that. But every time I see the show, I forget what's gonna happen next. I don't know why that is. I think because it's so, um, it's so environmental, you get so swept up in it. And then there's the music and the comedy and the tragedy. And, and then suddenly you go, like, oh, that's right. That's what happens next. So if I'm having that experience, what's it like for an audience? And you've just arrived back in the country. You said this morning, I mean, to be in Brisbane and Queensland. Yeah. I mean, it is your favourite spot in Australia. Is that right? <laughs> I mean, I don't want to get like attacked next time I go to some other part of Aussie, <laughs> but we love it here. And I think for the arts, I think for filmmaking, I think just in terms of an explosion of forward moving energy, it's a truly exciting place to be in this country. It really is.